It'll be the Nets off the tip. It's Kirilenko on the wing. The Nets working the ball around now. And the basket by Johnson. How in the world did they let him get that wide open? On defense, the Nets. It's a three-point game. It's Brown on the wing. They set the screen. And stolen by Darren Williams. And here we go. Brooklyn fast break. Johnson's got the ball. I'd say that fast break went according to plan. Yeah, it sure did. A good job getting it started and a better job finishing it off. Williams attacking and a foul on the shot. He'll go to the strike for two. Easy call there. No question about that one. You could hear the impact from where I am. First trip to the free throw line for him in this one. Marcus Williams. Two shots. And he knocks down the first one. That one misses, so he goes one for two. And it's Johnson penetrating. Good. Johnson's got five points so far. The defense left him just a little window to get through, and he just ducked in for the layup. Terrific job. Williams kicks to Brown. Baseline Jay on the way. Rebound, Brooklyn. Well, he's been trying to add that mid-range shot to his arsenal, but it still isn't there. Dishes to Garnett. And it's in after a nice bounce off the right side. Garnett's got his first basket. Excellent ball movement there, guys. Yeah, I think that's what's keyed this run, Clark, because they're keeping the ball moving. Defense hasn't been able to set up. Now here's Brown. And the baseline jumper, no good. And that's a shot he had to take. For sure, it was a good decision, just poor execution. Over in the corner, Williams. The three. That's in coming off an assist from Johnson. Pretty impressive. Five straight makes to start this game. Now here's Williams. They could use a big shot here to get this offense going. Sure could, Kev. I mean, too many empty trips. They need some points. Back to Brown. A picture-perfect screen play in the... Jumper's good. That's a big basket. You don't want to let the game get away from you right off the bat. Garnett with the screen for Williams. Rob out in his own on the break. Here's Kolnetsis. Throws down the breakaway jam. Terrific job on both ends of that sequence. Very slick steal and then excellent transition offense. Well, it all stems from the aggressive defense. And when you attack defensively and you can force some mistakes, now it's off to the races. Now here's Johnson. Five points in the game. Stolen away. Paul Nietzsche. He's guarded by Johnson. Over in the corner, Williams. Here's Kolnetis, and that is good. Well, he can squeeze himself into the box score every now and then. We're about three minutes into this first quarter. Nets leading by five. Williams with the ball. Here's Lopez. They grab their own miss. Pass to Williams. Johnson, wide open, he fires. And the Nets miss again. Coach is liking Clark what he's seeing from his offense. And shoot, why wouldn't he? I mean, guys, they're filling it up with ease, executing, getting quality shots. I mean, this is fun to watch. Yeah, this is like a clinic out there, guys. This is exactly how you attack a defense. Move the ball, sharp cuts, but really a nice pace to their offense. Shot clock at two. The offensive rebound. Here's Merrick. And the officials whistle a foul on the shot. The bucket's good. He'll go to the line. Locomotives shooting their third free throw shot of the game. Alex Marich shooting one. The Nets with the lead. And Williams, here we go, kicks it to Lopez.
Here's Kalnetis. And you can count it. He'll go to the line with a chance to make it three. All right. at how the hustle game has been going for Locomotive. Well, I think the defensive aggressiveness on display here has caught him off guard, playing airtight defense and coming up with the steals. And the other thing they're doing is forcing a lot of turnovers, and that's helping them to get easy points at the other end. Obvious foul. Yeah, he took a hit right there and earned those free throws. The Nets shooting their first free throws of the game on this trip to the line. Well, they were 75% free throw shooting a season ago. Both free throws good for Williams. Here's locomotive Kuban Krasnodar with the ball. It's a 12-2 run here. Good pace. Passes it to Brian. Expanding his range. That's good. Brown's got five now. Boy, that was a rugged screen set there, fellas, and the defense didn't even try to go through that one. Williams attacking. That's good. Everybody on the floor is hot. Incredible stuff here in the early stages. Tell you what, both teams playing downhill. Who's going to blink first? And Locomotive with possession here. Marich, Lopez covering. Over to the left wing. And stolen by Williams. And now here's Johnson, the fast break chance. And it's Williams that time, the assist by Johnson. Johnson's got his fourth assist in this one. So nice to have a guy like that who can take charge at any time. Yeah, so many of his passes, Steve, have led directly to baskets. And Locomotive with possession here. Trailing by two. Got a piece of it. Kevin Garnett with the steal. Johnson outside. Here's Lopez. And he lays it straight in. Lopez has got his first basket. Let's look at the energy stats, how the hustle game has been going for Brooklyn. And they've come out in attack mode defensively, applying pressure and stealing the ball repeatedly. You know, another factor in their offense so far has been their ability to convert and score off turnovers. Here's Brown following the basket by Brooke Lopez. That's good. That's like a layup. Now here's Williams. Nine points in the game so far. Garnett inside. He's covered by Brown. Williams dishes to Garnett. Locomotive pulls it in. Outside Williams. Brown the pass to Williams. There's a good screen. To the inside. And stolen by Darren Williams. Garnett kicks to Lopez. Williams attacking. Lopez. Has no luck. And here is Williams. Simon guarded by Kirilenko, and they take the lead. He has five. Back and forth we go. That basket gives us just another lead change. And there have been too many of those to keep track of. What a contest. Now here's Johnson. He's got five. Misses from close range. Pretty good defense there. I mean, that's a shot that he can make, but they really challenged him. Williams attacking. Call Nietzsche's. Guarded by Kirilenko. It's rebounded by Kevin Garnett. Brooklyn trailing. Williams dishes to Kirilenko. Right side, Kirilenko. The jump hook, and he gets the bucket. Kirilenko's got his second bucket of the game to go. Three consecutive baskets have come right at the rim. The defense had better start buckling down and tightening up. Yeah, they're getting exposed right now. Now, here's Brown. He's got five. 
Simon guarded by Kirilenko. Just four to shoot. Here's Simon. Misses off the left iron. Brooklyn with the ball on the wing. Johnson. Rob. And here we go. Here's Williams. And that one goes in as he is fouled. It'll be three points if he converts at the line. Really tough to get that shot off with the size differential there. That's not an individual matchup he's going to win every time, especially in the post. Very well done. I didn't think he had any business operating down there with the big fellas. Both teams deciding to change it up. He's made one and missed one so far in the game. It's the Nets now. Trailing by two. Bogdanovich passes to Jack. The three from Anderson. That is good. Anderson's got himself going there. His first points of the game on the deep ball. On Khrushchev, defended by Jack. Right wing. There's a good screen. The pass to Pankrashov. Rumley with the block. That was a good rebound right there, but they haven't been very strong on the glass so far. Well, they They've got to meet the energy that they're facing right now. So important to battle on the boards. Here's Jay Sidus. The shot is off. And Brooklyn will now go the other way with it. And Jack, here we go. And here's Anderson from the arc. And a great assist by Jack as that one goes in. And now a four-point Nets lead. And Locomotive with possession here. Here's Jay Sidus. Tried to answer back, but that three is off the mark. Guy is a potent offense right now. Yeah, Kevin, really the offense is flowing quite nicely right now. Playing with a lot of confidence, just you know, some self-assurance. I, I like what we're seeing. I tell you what, they're up early here in the first, but if they keep turning the ball over, that's not going to last. Yeah, it's amazing. They've got five turnovers already. I mean, I, this lead will vanish if they continue to mishandle the ball like this. And Locomotive with possession here. Four-point game. Bogdanovich grabs the miss. And the Nets with possession. Six seconds separating the shot and game clocks. Here's Toledovich. He hasn't yet put up any points in this one. Plumley. The Nets shooting their third and fourth free throw shots of the night. That's good from Plumley. Locomotive, Kubin Krasnodar making a switch here. Humley hits them both. 15 seconds left here in the first quarter. Pass to Pankrashov. To the left side wing. Here's Jay Sidus. And a kind roll that time off the rim as that one falls. A free-flowing first quarter. Great scoring through one. Nets out in front, leading by four. And back in a moment as we'll get underway with quarter number two. I got my money. Now the second quarter getting ready to start up. And uh, from Brooklyn guys, what jumps out to you stat-wise? And they've done a nice job here offensively to establish a rhythm and a pace to this game. And I like that they're finding ways to score. Playing well here, Steve. Locomotive trails by four. Now let's go to Doris Burke. Doris. Well, guys, Andre Kirilenko, best known for his defense, but very sneaky on the offensive end. He said, in America, they're so concentrated on the individual game, beating your man one-on-one. -on -one. I've never been a great shooter, but moving without the ball is underestimated and undervalued. If you can find the opportunities, you can be twice as effective. 
Kevin. A great pass or two, Norris. He keeps it moving offensively. Thanks. That's some more rugged play from them inside. They have a decent edge in rebounds thus far. And that hard work on the boards needs to continue. That could be what swings this game eventually. Plumley, no luck. Here's the floater. And it's blocked. And we played through the first uh, minute here in the second. And the shot is good. Those are starting to add up. Of their last five baskets, three of them have been three-pointers. And it's not just great offense, Clark. The defense is really lacking. Not enough energy on their closeouts. And Locomotive with possession here. They trail by seven. Passes it to Pankrashov. Five on the clock. High arcing shot, and he gets it to go. Second quarter of basketball, just over a minute and a half played so far. And Jack kicks to Bogdanovic. And it's rejected. Inside, here's Jay Sinus. Tolenovic grabs the board. He has not been on his game, and, you know, their deficit isn't totally on him, but he has not helped the situation. Anderson dishes to Plumley. Shoots from 12, and he gets the bucket. <laughs> Ah, uh, the turnaround jumper. That was a thing of beauty. And here in the second quarter of action with a hair under two and a half minutes played so far. Here's Jacaninko. And so it looks like Locomotive will retain possession here. So both teams making some changes here. 14 seconds on the shot clock. 14. Substitution. Simon, guarded by Kirilenko. Here's Simon. Tries again, and it's sent back by Plumley. Oh, they're now plus five in the rebound category, really controlling the glass. And rebounding is one of those non-glamour stats. I mean, it takes work and effort and tenacity and physicality. Um, but when you look at the scoreboard, you can see the correlation. Johnson, the pass to Bogdanovich. Lock at six. Here's Williams. Makes it off the glass. And it's a nine-point Nets lead. Not much the defense can do once he gets to the bucket. Williams has gone four for four from the field. Perfect so far. The pass to Simon. They set the pick. Beyond the arc. And again, it's Locomotive, Kuban, Krasnodar missing. Not able to find it here in the second. He's off stride and off track just a bit after that one he had earlier. Kirilenko kicks to Johnson. Oh, and he misses the dunk. Johnson's gone two of five from the floor. Here's Jakunenko. And again, it's Locomotive, Kubin, Krasnodar missing. Pass to Bogdanovich. Johnson outside. And he uses the glass on the layup. Johnson's got the lead up to 11 now for Brooklyn. Well, every once in a while, he'll show us some pretty good moves around the hoop. Clark, they've been struggling here on offense. Yeah, a little bit of cotton mouth here. Dry spell for sure. Pass to Simon. Tries to snap the cold streak. And he gets it to go. I tell you what, he loves getting looks like that from the three-point line. No one near him. That's a warm-up jumper for him. Kirilenko with the screen for Williams. Kirilenko kicks to Plumley For three. Johnson's shot is off. A clear look at the hoop. He doesn't miss many of those. And the official signal the backcourt violation. Not very careful there. So both teams making some changes here. Here is Williams. He's got 11. 
with the shot. Johnson can't hit. They've been able to get out to this lead without really getting a very reliable performance out of him from the field. Simon. And again, it's Locomotive with a three. That's how to orchestrate for your teammate. Terrific pass. Johnson attacking. It's Kirilenko on the wing. He's covered by Brown. Kirilenko dishes to Johnson. Johnson right side. Just five to shoot. The second chance effort. Lopez passes to Bogdanovich. Tries yet again. And count the basket. He was fouled, and he's going to the line for one more. Strong rebounding, and he's rewarded with the easy putbacks. Kevin Garnett, he's checked in for Bogdanovich. The Nets have been solid at the line so far. Four for four. Locomotive trails by eight. Williams kicks to Brown. Brown with a screen on Kirilenko. Here's Simon. And so he draws the foul on the shot. A trip to the line to shoot two. Locomotive shooting their sixth and seventh free throws in the game. The first one falls. At the line for two. It's also good, so he hits both free throws. He has such terrific form and consistency on his free throws. Beautiful to watch. Kirilenko dishes to Garnett. The baseline jumper goes down. Garnett's got his second bucket. You know, as soon as he recognized the height mismatch, he immediately pulled up for the jumper. As he should. That's a good decision. When he gets a clean look, he's got to take it. Now here's Williams. Passes it to Simon. Back to Williams. Brown outside. And it's off from three-point range. Nets leading by eight. Lopez sets a screen for Johnson. The dish now to Lopez. Uses the glass to finish the layup. Lopez has got five points now in the quarter. What a great little run he's on here in the quarter. Lopez has gone three for five from the field. The feed now to Brown. The kick out to Williams. Back to Brown. He tries for three. The basket is good off the assist from Williams. Brown's got eight points. How about the passing? They are moving the ball without any thought, without any agenda. It's hard to overstate all the points they've scored on assist today. Beautiful to watch. Now here's Garnett. Kirilenko the pass to Garnett. Garnett right side. Nice shot from 10 feet out. He has six. They've owned the offensive glass here in the second. Yeah, they're really trying to make a point of getting inside of the paint and getting after every rebound. Here's Brown. Eight points for him. Williams passes to Simon. Got a piece of it. Here's Marich. Count that one. Here's Williams. It's Kirilenko on the wing. He's looking for Lopez and finds him. Left side, Williams. Tries from 10, and that one's good. Williams has got 13. Pretty much all of their buckets coming from inside the paint now. Yeah, that's five of their last six baskets inside the lane. They have really established themselves inside. And Locomotive with possession here. Nine-point game. And I think the lead they've built here, guys, is in large part due to what they've done on the boards. Absolutely. I mean, they have a plus-10 advantage in rebounds, and they've been in total control of the backboard. And Garnett misses. The screen from Brown. 
And there's the call. It's going to be an illegal screen. Yeah, good call there. You could tell he was moving into the defender when he tried to set the screen. Yeah, lowered that shoulder, dipped right into him, too. I mean, he was going to be called on that foul either way. So both teams changing it up here. And Jack, here we go. Back to Williams. Anderson kicks to Williams. And yes, sir, that one drops. Williams has got the lead up to 11 now for the Nets. Just seems like they're finding an open lane to the hoop every time down. It's five buckets in a row for them in the paint. Yeah, on the flip side, Steve, the defenders have to show more fight on the interior. Now here's Williams. He feeds it to Brown. Out to the right wing. Brown with a screen on Williams. Here's Pankrashov. The pick gave him all the room he needed, and he knocks down the chain. That's just a case of two teammates working perfectly together, one setting the screen and the other using it to get that separation. Jack dishes to Lopez. Nice ball movement by Brooklyn. The basket counts and one. He'll go to the line with a chance to make it a three-point play. The Nets shoot their sixth attempt at the charity stripe in the game. We've got 28 seconds left to play here in the second quarter. Pankrashov, the pass to Brown. Williams sets a screen for Brown. For the three, Brooklyn with the rebound. Well, offensively, they've kind of settled for outside shots so far. You know, I don't know if they're shying away from contact, Steve, um, but their free throw attempts also down from the first quarter. And Anderson gets it to go. What a beautiful assist. That's a couple of teammates clearly on the same page. And that concludes the first half. Nets lead by 15. We're going to step away briefly, but get you right back out here for the start of the third quarter after our halftime. It's been a one-sided affair so far through the first two quarters, but there's plenty.